Welcome back to the Basic Bikers YouTube channel. Smart Ayrshire Vlogster here. How you all doing? Hope you are doing well. So I've just switched the cameras on. I'm making my way to the lid down. Making my way to get a new back brake disc, new back pads, new front tyre so it starts to get colder and wetter and windier that's, that's me starting to work on the bike for over the winter but I still will be out riding as anybody that knows me will know that so it's a local mechanic I'm going to use just keeping the business locally so he'll complete the work for me today so as I said just switch the camera zones never know what might happen so stay tuned I'll be back just after the intro oh well this is turning into quite a thing So welcome back. Just making my way along the Dawson Shore. Hi, right, so if you're new to the channel, check out our other videos. If you like what you see. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you know when we're uploading. To my current subscribers, thanks for your continued support. Uh, so I'm about five minutes away. As I said, I'm just going to get a local guy to do the work. I've used them before. Keep the business local, help out the local businesses, whatever way you want to put it. So we'll be dropping off the bike and getting public transport home. This will be the first time I've been in a bus in uh, a long time. I would imagine it's not going to be good, but we'll wait and see. Well, that's me picked the bike back up. So that's new front rubber, new rear disc, new rear pads. I'll go and try and put a couple of miles on her. So that's it, matching set of Road 5s, Michelin Road 5s. For the rear on a couple of weeks. I found a big difference with it compared to the battle axe that was on it. So, hoping it's the same for the front. But it's uh, really, really windy, as you would expect. I 
but it's a nice day. It's about eight degrees, seven, eight degrees. A wee bit of boy, but that's the way it always is. Feel a massive difference with that front new front tire. New rubber always feels good when you're on the bike. Blind there. So next is a wee oil change, wee filter change. And we've got a deep clean. But I'll continue to go out. As I always do. Aye, so. It's the 13th of November. Friday the 13th. Probably not the best day. To break in a new front tyre, but needs must. Uh, so England's in lockdown still, full lockdown. The area of Ammons, tier 3, Ayrshire and Arne. In fact, may say Central Belt, all of the Central Belt is in tier 3. And Wales just came out their fire break that they had. So I think while well, you've got the opportunity at the moment should get on your bikes good for you. Obviously the weather's going to change and whatever tier you're in might change. Ah, you're okay, mate. You're okay. Thank you. I'm trying to move out of the way. Don't really get much hassle for cars in my area. They're well aware we can filter and all the other stuff that we can do, so I never ever get any hassle, to be honest. Which is always a good thing. Aye, so what was I saying, aye? Get in the bike while you still can, there's nothing stopping you. If you're staying within your own area and you're not travelling to an area that's a tier below you, then you've got the whole of the central belt. For me, I've got the whole of the central belt, so... As long as I'm not meeting up with anybody, you can have one other person with you. And at the moment in Scotland there's no restrictions in law about changing tiers. Now that could change by the time I put this video up. So you don't need to blast in the comments something rang because it could have changed. 
I think they're already she's already talking about changing it to put it in law about travelling. Then there's the good news of the vaccine. Depends if you class it as good news. There's plenty of people out there who will not touch it. Regardless of what they say it will do for you, protection wise. But each to their own. It's up to you how you feel about it all. Face masks. The possibility of having a vaccine to take. So. It's everybody's choice what they decide to do. But yeah, well you've got that opportunity, I would keep getting out on the bike until the salt goes down or the snow comes or whatever it is that is your final when you decide to stop. When you decide to stop riding for the winter if you choose to do that. Could possibly get another good two, three, four weeks at this before we get to the stage of grit going down. All the government try to prevent you from going out. For me, my choice is I'll keep going out. I enjoy it, makes me feel better, you've seen it all in my previous videos how I feel about this, how I feel about biking, two wheels and everything else that goes with it. Hi right, anyway, back to the tyres, so that's a set of Michelin Road 5's on, I started a previous video where when I got the rear tyre put on, so I'll continue on that, I'll let you know how I got on. But you probably noticed that the new models for 2021, there's a lot of them getting fitted with this tyre. It's an expensive tyre, but it's supposed to be fantastic in the way, and this is all the stuff I'll come back to you with. If it is as good as that, that's why I'm not trying to let me buy. I'm quite happy sitting like this while I'm talking to you. Right, so I'll report back. I'll report back on the tyres, how I'm getting on with them. But so far that rear tyre made a massive difference against the battle axe that was on it beforehand. Sorry, I don't have the model number of the tyre and it was battle axes I had my ZX6R which I found were fantastic and it was P Pirelli Corsos on the uh, SRAD 750 but there has been a major difference confidence wise as well There was a big difference with that as soon as I put that rear tyre on. So much so that I started to feel the front losing grip more often or not. So that's me, I should be happy with this. Well, that's me. Got some miles on some back roads there. So just heading in. Put the bike away. So if you're new to the channel, check out my other videos. If you like what you see, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you know when I'm uploading. Don't forget to hit the bell. To my current subscribers, thanks for your continued support. 
as always and I'll catch you the next time. Cheers!